Okay, so um, can you hear me well in the back? I guess I'm gonna try, try to speak a little loud, louder. Uh, I'm starting here because one of the thing, the big story about accessories actually is all about, is mainly about link. So one of the things that we've done this year, we've done, we've started the process previously, but one, one of the things we've done this year is basically to develop the uh, adapter plate for link for the two up spark. Uh, last year we had the one for the three up uh, that was mounted on the extension uh, plate at the rear of the vehicle. This year basically we're, uh, we're offering now the, uh, the link anchor base for the two up spark. Now mounted on that vehicle, I just also want to bring your attention to that bag that is, uh, that is being launched. Uh, this is a completely waterproof bag. It's uh, 40 liter, it's, 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 uh, rug, it's rug construction. It's basically using the construction we've been using on the ski and on the off-road side with a semi-rigid construction. And, and as I said, it has a link base and this one is marinized. For those of you that didn't notice, it has the blue lever. Basically, it's just an indicator that uh, we have all stainless steel hardware inside, so no possibility of having uh, rust. On the, on, on the mechanism. Also on this vehicle, you can, uh, you can see that uh, we've added new uh, floorboard wedges. It's, uh, it's something that we've taken over the uh, ErgoLock system that we have on the, uh, on the, on the lineup unit. Uh, it's, it's exactly the ones that we are using on the lineup the, with the only exception of rubber uh, shims at the rear in order to make sure that it really mimic the shape of the floorboard so it's really perfectly mounted and snug fit on, on the floorboard. Uh, if we go to the vehicle just beside, you'll also see that uh, we're combining the floorboard wedge with newly developed uh, knee pads. So again, it, it acts as the same way as what we have on the ErgoLock units, on the full-size units. It really helps you to get a, a tight, like uh, you, you can do aggressive riding. It, it basically uh, attach you to the vehicle per se. So uh, this is those two togethers are not being sold as a complete kit. It, they are sold separately, but together they're really uh, making a perfect co perfect combination. Now before we go forward, uh, I just want to re, uh, re reiterate the fact that uh, covers. Uh, we've launched that back in 2018 with the convenience of having access to handlebars or fuel cap if you want to refuel the vehicle on the trailer and also uh, access to the link accessories. That, uh, that cover was also, uh, was also updated in order to fit Spark. Well, not this cover, but, but we also have a SKU now for the Sparks uh, with uh, link accessories at the rear. So you have a car, you have a you have a, an opening at the rear in order to get access to the, uh, the accessories and it also allow you to uh, trailer your vehicle using the link accessories onto the vehicle and not needing to remove it. Um, this is not new from this year, but just uh, as a reminder, we also offer comfort seat for Spark. Uh, we have that for the tree up and for the two, uh, the two up unit. It's perfectly retrofitable. So it, it, it has a different density, slightly different shape, much more comfortable than the, conf the, than, than the stock seat. Uh, the stock seat is really good when you, do, uh, w when you, you ride it like uh, once, once in a while, but this one, if you want to do some more touring, this one has a uh, more uh, comfortable seat. Um, going to the wall near, uh, behind you, sorry, I'm gonna just go here. So here we have uh, bin organizers. These were launched back in 2018 18 with the introduction of the new uh, vehicle. Uh, what we have new this year is basically a new model for the GTI platform. So it's pretty much the same thing, but given the fact that the, uh, the storage bin has shape has changed slightly, uh, we're now offering a new one with that uh, plastic reinforced ring on the perimeter of the bag. But the rest of it is pretty much the same construction with the meshing that allows uh, wet gears to, to, to dry in a bag. The other neat thing this year is the introduction of uh, electrical end grip, heated grip. So basically uh, you have the grip here uh, with an embedded heating elements and you also have embedded uh, button. So that has uh, five different heating levels. You can see here the little window. So it's basically showing you which levels you're at. 
it's a perfect retrofit to any units all the way up to 2011. So if you have a new unit like a 2018 and up, uh, you can use that like it is. But uh, if you have an older unit, the only difference is that you'll need a different harness because of the connectors that are different in the uh, older, older system. These units are, uh, these uh, heated grips are installed on the Fish Pro and on the GT GTX you have in the back. Uh, those units are connected. We have a power pack that uh, power those units. So if you want to give it a try, you can power them up and you'll feel the difference. C'est pour C'est pas pour, uh, pour les speaker. Uh, ski pylon. This is not the, the new ski pylon uh, using the link. However, I'm going to use that to, to tell you that uh, we've updated the, uh, the ski pylon, so now it also fits the new platform, the GTI. So you only have one SKU to fit on all units. So GTX, GTI, RXT, all those units will be able to use the same SKU. Now, again, this is not this one. Uh, the one that uh, you're going to be using is uh, on the link table in the back. So when you'll have a chance, if you walk around the showroom, you'll be able to see, uh, to see the, the differences between the previous model. The, also, the, the reason why we're showing the wakeboard older here at the bottom is because uh, it's, it's just a reminder that this will also fit now on the new unit as well. The only difference, and you'll see that in the, in the accessory catalog, are brackets, different brackets, because of the uh, shear line on the boat that are slightly different, bumper that are slightly different. Uh, we're using a different mounting system. But aside from that, the mechanism is the same and the uh, older itself is the same. Uh, before we proceed to the um, before we proceed to the link table, there was one last thing that I wanted to show you. You can see that at the, at the uh, really end of the uh, of the wall right there is uh, is basically the fishing seat, but the accessory version of the fishing seat. So we've changed basically the skin of the seat with a different with a color that is a little more generic. So if you want to retrofit the fishing seat onto any kind of units, any units with different colorations, uh, this is the way to go. So. Uh, slightly different, you can see uh, the, uh, the little, uh, uh, the little uh, not drawings, but little embossed on the seat that are slightly different as well. But aside from that, same foam, same density, same shape, only the color is different. Um, audio kit for Spark, but that is obviously not new, so it, we continue to sell this one. We didn't make any change for this one. For those of you that may have questions about uh, the communications that the communication that was recently sent for the recall of the base, uh, I would invite you to just to come come to see me after the presentation, and I'll I'll be able to give you some more details if you have questions. Um, going to the link table at the rear. Tu vas pas parler? Je pensais qu'on était quatre cinq, puis là finalement la parole est allée. On ne m'entend pas beaucoup? Oui, OK. So, basically, the reason why I wanted to bring you here, uh, some of the accessories you've already seen, but the reason why I wanted to bring you here is just again to reiterate the fact that Link is now available on all of our units. It's retrofitable on, on legacy units, but it's also embedded on the new unit. You can see it right here with the GTX. You have the same system on the GTI. You have the same system on the RXT. So all of these accessories that we internally call like 16 inch link, because for those of you that knows the other brand, uh, we also have different standard, but the 16 inch accessories, which are the ones right here, uh, can be installed on any of the units uh, that, that are using the link, uh, link anchor base. Now, you see the bag that I was talking about earlier. We still have the, uh, the, 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 the jerry can, the, the, marinized, the marinized jerry can. We have also a toolbox that can be mounted, uh, watertight as well. And on the other end, you have the cooler. Now, for those of you that uh, wonder why the cooler is now gray, is we've made that change. Uh, it was what we internally call running change uh, towards the gray. We had few concerns from, from customers that uh, the white one was uh, easy to get dirty and difficult to wash. So the texture on the, on the cooler has changed in the color as well. So now uh, it is, we're going to be offering the light gray. So slowly but surely, we're phasing out the inventory of the white one towards the, the gray one. But aside from the color, it's exactly the same. Now, uh, as I was, I was saying earlier, the, um, the uh, end grips are installed on the Fish Pro and on the, uh, on the GTX just behind. 
I'll invite you to give it a try. It's really, uh, it's, it, it works really well. It's super comfortable. You got eat uh, on all your ends because even the palm are being eaten with that eating elements that is embedded in the end grips. Uh, and also, uh, I haven't had a chance yet, but if, for those of you that wants to try the sound system, all of those units will be connected, so you'll, you'll, you'll be able to hear, uh, hear from the different units. Now, something that I didn't mention, because we're pretty much at the end of the presentations of the new accessories for this year, the other thing that I wanted to mention is uh, audio kit for GTI. Basically, those vehicles now uh, have uh, audio kit, like something that we didn't have before. Those audio kits are being offered also as an accessory, so for, for those that didn't order that from the get-go with the unit, you can always buy that as an accessory kit, just like what we did for the, the GTX. Um, Sophie, am I missing anything? No, I think we're good. Perfect. If you have any questions, you can ask right away. Or, uh, otherwise, I'm going to be standing here for, for the entire day, so feel free to come and see me, and I'll guide you to uh, different uh, accessories that were developed this year.